What is in here in three, two, one? It's a twisted T-Rex one! He's not so bad. Ugh. I smell ultra rares. Welcome to Adventure Fun. <laughs> Okay guys, we got the full collection here of Zuro's Smashers Epic Dino Egg Series 3. And we got the three different bones, so you gotta look for those if you want the three different characters. So you're gonna have like the off-white bone, then you got the green bone, and then you got the eggshell white, Navajo white. Oh, it's just whiter than this off-white here. So let's go ahead and take a look at these and begin with this one right here. Zuro Smashers Epic Dino Egg. Over 25 surprises, and it's a Series 3 dino. And then down below, you can see it says contains 25 pieces. So over 25 surprises, well, if you got 25 pieces, I guess the over means that you didn't get 26. And then you got the green bone right there. And so what creature that's gonna be, I don't know. And then over on the back, it says uh, Zero Smashers Epic Dino Egg, and it's got Smash, Dig, Build, and more. It's the biggest dino surprise in ages. The Zero Smashers Epic Dino Egg is packed with over 25 dino might surprises for you to discover. Unwrap and follow the map. Then Smash, Fizz, Slime, Dig, and build the ultimate Smashosaur. And then it's got all of those pretty pictures down below about smashing, sliming, fizzing, digging, finding, building, and more. And then it says collect all Smashosaurs, and there's a total of three. You have the Twisted Tyrannosaurus Rex, then you have Crazy Bone Brachiosaurus, and then Fossil Rock Triceratops. And I'd say looking at Twisted Tyrannosaurus Rex, where he's got the green goober on his lips, I thought that that would be the green bone, but then you got Crazy Bone, he's got goober coming out of his eyes, green stuff. And then you got the Fossil Rock Triceratops, he's got green just out of his nose. I don't know. I say the nose ones wins. I think this is Triceratops. We'll soon find out. And then um, on the side here, it says it includes one epic dino egg, one dino egg yolk bag, one scratch and find map, one digging tool, one dino glowing slime, one ice age putty. <laughs> You're putting me on. One fossil rock, one fizzy lava volcano, one dino dirt sand, six mini smash eggs with six surprise characters. Smash it! That's going to be fun. And one smash egg rebuilder, one smash sword, one instruction sheet, and one collector's guide. <gasps> Hopefully they're involved with ultra rares because I like collecting things that that not a lot of other people have. What well, makes it so fun? Okay, to open this up, we got a perforation here with the dots going down on the side. So to open this up, may the fork be with you always because I'm gonna use that to get in between the egg and the plastic. Oh. Yeah, I was afraid of that. I think they have two sets of plastic. Yeah, see, there's the first layer, and then here's the second layer. And so this one will tear through that, but not this other part. But Okay, now we can barely see the perforations on that side, but they have something, uh, lines on the back here that are more distinct, clear. So I'm wondering if I'm able to uh, get this down. Oh yeah, see that's like butter. Okay, we know how to do it. So yeah, don't be fooled by that. We're good. Take a look at the egg, guys. It's goo. Look at that. You got little like uh, bones here, like a snake, and then you got little bug splats. And then it says smashes here, and you got, it looks like the T-Rex. So I think the, all of them are going to have the T-Rexes, you know, just the regular logo for it. But what's inside, we'll soon find out. So let's go ahead and to break it open, I mean, you can sit there and squeeze it and give it lots of love until it pops open or, you know, you can just do it. Oh, 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 like Don Knotts, you know, oh, he just uh, hurts his hand. Look at that, that is full of air. That's one big bubble. Oh. And then we got our instruction guide and collector's guide in there. But first guys, take a look at that thing. And he looks like he's just in like in an embryo state, you know, like he's ready to just pop out or like a big meteor hit him. And he's just all burned up and all you have is left is his bones. It's a dead man's party. Who could ask for more? Dead dinosaur party. So before we do that, let's just go ahead and you can rebuild it, right guys? So you can do your smashing all over again. And if I can rebuild it, so can you. <laughs> Gonna take me a little bit of effort here. Oh, that was pretty easy so far. And there's a front or a back uh, particular side to this here. Does it really matter? Oh, maybe I got it right the first time. Sweet, guys. A little bit. Okay, go cool. put that to the side. Before we open that up, let's open up our collector's guide. It's got tape. Oh, well, I'll just have a little bit of finger muscles. Look at that. You got two sides, but the first side is a scratch and sniff. Oh, I wish it was a scratch and sniff, you know. I smell dinosaur land. Ooh, it's decayed dinosaur. It smells like oil. That's what happens after several years, you know. Zero Smasher Scratch Map. Scratch and follow the clues to find everything you need to build your mystery Smashosaur. And then you go, you got the start with the snotty nosed uh, Triceratops. And then one, don't keep your head in the sand. You know what, to even do that, we gotta pop this open, right? 
Oh. And then we'll cover the different types of um, little uh, collector uh, dudes you can get. The Smash Ball and the little characters inside. It goes all the way up to Ultra Rares. There's only like a total of six Ultra Rares. I'm excited. Okay, so here we go, guys. It looks both on the same sides, right? Uh, yes, it looks the same on both sides. And then you got a little scissors right there. And if you listen very carefully, boys and girls, you're going to hear a as we crack open the stinky egg. In fact, you see the little tag right there? That's where they inject the air into it to pump it up. And so then it seals on its own. Okay, here we go. Let's see if we can get the pss. <laughs> 20,000 years in the eggshell. Whew. Oh, yeah. Wow. Now you can really... I was just joking, but no, you can really smell it. You want to smell that camera, yeah. Mom? Fast. That is plasticky. That is like, oh, toxicity. I've been to that city before. Tox. Toxicity. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Oh, it's a bundle of goodies. Oh, all for me. Yay. Including the smell. Whew. Let's let that air out for a bit. Oh, my gosh. Ice Age Putty. <laughs> You're putting me on. And then Glowing Slime. Look at that creature, man. He's just freaking me out. Look at that. Uh, that's something I'd expect to pick out of a boogie. <laughs> you can see me in the dark. You picking your nose again? No, I'm not. How do you know? I can see him glowing. Pew, 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 pew. Okay. <laughs> And then there's dino dirt. Let's get down into the dirt. Oh, this is so cool. And there's the lava fizzy. All right. And there's fossil rock. Sounds like a landmark. And then we got our, what, tomahawk, our hatchet, and then we got our egg smasher builder. Okay, I'm gonna open that up first. Man, this is a professional kit, guys. Once you smash these smashers here and you find out what's in, oh, I, I think that's an ultra rare. I smell ultra rares. And you know, you build it like that, you can put treats and candy, oh, that's fun. We're gonna have fun with that. And then there's the smasher. Oh, and it's the, you, know, you got a little shovel or a little scraper here, but this is supposed to maybe hit the fossil rock. I don't know, but it's got some instructions on the ins, who we, oh, I think this is who we're building. I think it's a give, I, 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 I give, I give, I give, a dead giveaway. Okay, there's the front and there's the back. You probably can't see it, but we'll go ahead and just scan it in so you guys can see both front and the back. This is the googly eye builder, dude. The googly eye is a crazy bone brachiosaurus. So, okay, guys, you want the googly eye? It's the green bone, okay? See right there, that's a googly eye right there. Brachiosaurus, crazy bone. Oh, it sounds like a Western. You know, ah, crazy bone, he'll get you, man. Well, that's what we're in. So it's got the steps on how to, you know, how to build the dude. And then on the other side, of course, it's going to have all the uh, parts for the egg when you want to rebuild it. So let's build our crazy bone. But we got to do the steps first, right, guys? One, don't keep your head in the sand. <laughs> Is it dirt? Uh, you know, dirt and sand, it could mean the same thing, right, guys? But to find out, we're gonna have to scratch. So we need a clean, clean. We got our Scooby Doo. I can smell gold. Guys, you wanna watch the Treasure X videos? Because on almost all our videos, I think all our videos, most if not all, we get gold. And if we don't, we'll go out and buy the gold. <laughs> okay, <laughs> we're gonna get it. So we're gonna take this uh, coin, and you can see it's like, oh, so cool. The Treasure X. You gotta watch our Treasure X videos. They have so many cool looking pictures in there, guys. You got the skull and crossbones there with the Davy Jones hat, kind of. And then Plunder Pound or pace punk peso so I don't know who that was but anyways so let's go ahead and scratch off the first one okay we're getting down right dirty I gotta do a good scratching okay let me get it okay so there you go it's the dino dirt so the dirt threw me away you know they said sand so okay the sands of time so you got a little uh, divot there so you pinch above below it and then tear it Ow. And it's so close to the top, you only get like a little bit open, so hopefully you can get the rest. So yeah, guys, I mean, that's where dinosaurs come from. I mean, that's where you get the oil, is dead dinos. And you get the bones left over, and so they're kind of at home in their own oil kangaroo pouch, as it were. Okay, let's see what we got here. Oh, wow. It looks like Play-Doh at first. Oh, no, that's, that feels good. Oh, yeah. This funky sand. Oh, it looks so cool, the yellow. The way it just kind of like ricochets off and kind of like scatters. And is it moldable? Can I actually get a big rock? No, that's a fossil. Also a noodle knocker. It's actually quite a bit. Yeah, there's a lot you get in here, guys. Hurry, buy them up now. Well, you can still get a lot for your money. <laughs> here we go. All right, so we have uh, his uh, tail. And then we got his upper and lower jaws, okay? Uh, I think without reading instructions, I can just go ahead and... Uh, I think I got it. Okay, so there you go. <laughs> All right, so that's the first part. That is so cool. I love it. Oh, look, guys, it's been fossilized. See, we got the leftovers from the tail. Mm -hmm. 
That's cool. All right. It's just also oh, satisfying. ASMR, whatever that means. But oh yeah, it just feels good to mash the, the imprint it back into itself here into the sand. That's cool dirt. All right. Next. Fizz up. Oh, like, you know, could it be fizzy? <laughs> okay. Well, we got to do it though. And it's the volcano here. So let's fizz up. Okay. I really needed the clue on this one. All right, it's the fizzy lava. So on the fizzy lava fizz up, uh, we gotta get a bowl to throw this honk thing into, and we'll just watch it fizz, okay? So let's find out what's in our fizz. We'll be right back. Okay, just so you guys know, with our fizzy lava, there's, the, you know, it looks like a lava volcano's about to blow. It says you need a fishbowl, otherwise you can't do it, because it says that you can't take a shower with it. Oh no, well, it's got water coming out of the shower head. I just can't take a bath with it. It's not for baths, okay, guys? I mean, this thing's like lava. It could burn you up. I don't know what the uh, FD whatever dies in it and stuff. Maybe that's not good for your skin, so we'll do it here. And I know this, this is probably going to stain my fingers. I might want to get like a rubber glove to pull this thing back out. But here you go, guys. What is in here in 3, 2, 1? Oh, you hear that? I was going crazy. Like, you know, Tums, orange juice, heartburn, acid indigestion. <laughs> That's all burn, lava burn. Look at that. It's going to take a millennia. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I can actually taste it. Gosh. Not sugary. Yeah, with that kind of orange, you'd think that they would just, like, make it something edible like vitamin C. I mean, it's quite the shot. Like, a billion uh, milligrams of vitamin C. Okay. I don't talk anything about gloves, but I'm putting them on. <laughs> I'm not diving my hands into no, like, orange 20 millennia old icker goo. I got, oh, you got something coming. Got them bones. Oh, oh, this is getting everywhere. Man, and what do we get? Hold on, I gotta, like, wash this off. We got a foot. There's one foot. Oh, man, it really smells. And thank goodness that these things float. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't want to have to, you know, scuba dive for it. Okay, yeah, it really's got like a funk to it, but it's super cool. The colors are like just kicking and popping. There you go, and it's still kind of bubbling and fizzing. Look, you can see right there. Look how orange that is. Kind of reminds you of Gujitsu, you know, it could be an inner goo. And bring out the inner goo! Oh, oh, oh like, what is that? I think we can only do one of these guys, open another one of these again. Oh, okay. <laughs> There's something, ugh. even when I talk, that stuff just comes into my tongue and it's got a bitterness to it. A bittering agent, man, I wouldn't drink that stuff. Well, you shouldn't, but. <laughs> it's like smoking. Yeah, it's still smoking, man. Oh, I gotta stop talking, because. <laughs> and next, we're out to number three. This clue's got ooze. I don't know, for a moment there, it kind of reminded me of an island, you know. Welcome to Fantasy Island. I'm Mr. Work. I'm your host. After the plane, plane. It's an old 70s show. Uh, um, so let's go ahead and scratch this. This clue's got ooze. Now, what do you think that's got ooze in it? Glowing slime. They're throwing me because I'm thinking slime is the same thing as ooze. Oh, okay. There you go. It's glowing slime. That's what it is. So it'd be cool to turn the lights off and see the slime glow. It'd be cool if it actually looked like this dude. <laughs> Okay, so glowing slime. Yeah, that orange thing's still hanging around, man. It's got the funk. So let's go ahead and just tear that up at the top. A little divot. And hopefully, oh, now the slime is like, it's hard. To, oh, wow. There's a lot of stuff in there. <laughs> this is the worst slime ever. Kind of reminded me of that maple syrup that we had today at the Hocus Pocus breakfast. Oh, that is so nasty. It was all stringy. It wasn't real maple syrup, you know. <laughs> this is not like, I guess, slime, but it's snotty alien slime. It's like something's munching and eating up there, just drooling. Ugh. That's the problem is I still got things that are coming out. Oh, I... Oh. Oh. Okay, guys, I'm going to play with it. But, come on, man, you're not a real kid if you don't play with your bare hands. Where's your adventure, Mr. Fun Dad? Oh, Man, you gotta pick your battles, man. <laughs> oh, you need to accessorize. I want it to make it pop. That's why I use gloves. That's not regular, like, slime, guys. This is like... Somebody's, like, having a sinus condition here, you know? <laughs> Just... <laughs> oh, man. I think we're gonna have to wash these off. But, yeah, there's the uh, body to it. And there's, I guess, part of the tail. Oh. Ooh. You like wanna feel that? No. 
Uh, it's like boogers, though, right? It is total snottage, man. Oh, that's that's wrong. That's uh, like Nickelodeon slime. I don't even dare make fun of it because it's so real. <laughs> <So>, it's <laughs> you. Okay, guys. Sorry for that display of horror. <laughs> We're now backing it down to G and G. Why did we ever open that up? It was just ah, slime, slime, slime. Okay, we're on to the next one, number four. Can you dig it? Can you dig it? Can you? I'm thinking it's this right here. It's fossil rock. You don't dig rock. You actually break it apart. But we'll see if that's what they're saying here. Okay. Yes, we can. And there you go. There's the picture. It shows you with your digger here and the fossil rock. Now it's gonna be messy and the rock's gonna fly everywhere. So, I think we're down to our last two paper plates. Guys, be sure to like and subscribe. Help fund us, okay? <laughs> we gotta make sure we keep this thing going. Okay, get a close up. There's the fossil rock. I mean, so cool, there's so many things to do. If it wasn't for that snot, I'd give this a 10 out of 10. At this point, it could change. Now it's a nine out of 10, because that just really freaked me out. But then you get a point for freaking me out. So it's a 10 out of 10, woo! Oh, does this smell? Why are things so smelly? Ugh. Oh man, it's an oxygen. I don't know if you guys get the same smell here, but okay. You know, put in the comments if you get something that's as funky as this. So let's just go ahead and... Oh wow. It just looks like a little pecker, you know, of <laughs> a bird. Oh, I just, can I break it with my muscles? Oh, camera mom's trying to do Woody Woodpecker. Maybe this has been sitting too long. We should have dug these out sooner, <laughs> okay? Now you got these bones right here. I think that's pretty much it. Just those two things, and if there's more, I don't know where it's at, but we'll put this to the side. Oh, What's look at that. What's the color? You know what? Do they need a washing? Let's put them in this bath here. <laughs> Maybe acid will eat it. How are you gonna get them out? I didn't think of that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay, time to take your afternoon cesspool bath. Uh, no, uh, nothing. You know the turkey where they have the dark meat? Well, there you go, there's the dark bone, and he wants the white meat, the white bone. You know, maybe Scooby would go for this. Uh, Shaggy wouldn't he go for the dark meat? Yeah. Oh. Roadie, 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 never ends. Okay, the last one. Five, ice to see you. Ice, age putty. Now we gotta confirm, man, because if I open this up, and this is the last one, and it's not the one we're supposed to open up, then I'm not gonna feel so well. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Ice Age Putty. Okay, well, hopefully it doesn't disappoint, and it doesn't stink, it doesn't ooze, it doesn't slime, it doesn't whatever. Okay, so there's the perforation right down there. Okay. And then the Ice Age Putty. We got a close up there. All right. Does it have two layers of plastic? Oh, I don't want to, like, miss and hit my finger. Okay, let's just give it a little break. Okay, putty, I think I'm okay with it. For the moment there, it looked a little too viscous. Uh, okay. I wonder if it's just gonna like be smelly welly. All right, here we go. All right, this is cool. This is like frozen. Look, I like warm likes and subscribes. He's got stars. Also would say, what she, what's that song she sing? Let it snow, let it snow, like and subscribe. All right, you can see that it's really cool because you can see the glitter in there. It's cool because it's not runny, and that's the good thing. <laughs> it's a good start. And we can easily pick the bones, and the bones look like they're white. This one just turned, I don't know what that was. <laughs> it's just, just wild. Oh, that's just too brown for me. There's that. It comes apart really well. And there's that, and here's that. Now, okay, take a look at this and see if you can see the reflection of the uh, snowflakes in there. Our winner of discontent. <laughs> this is upon us. Henry the third, the fourth, the fifth. It's one of those Shakespearean things. Okay, and then we we'll just go ahead and put it into a box. I really want to see if it bounces, you know. Oh yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> I have to wash that off. But it is pretty fun. It's really cool. Now this I can get into. Okay. Oh, oh, oh like and subscribe. <laughs> okay. On your lips. Ew. <laughs> All right, we're good. Ow, I hit the bone, okay. <laughs> all right, next we can actually build this thing, right? We got all the parts and let's get to it. Okay, so first thing we got the face. We did the face thing, we got the jaw. And then it says N, what's an N? Oh, it's a skinny one. Okay, so this one, and then it goes to the O. Oh, I think it's the big one. And it goes like this. Oh, satisfying snap, gotta have your hair satisfying snap. Oh, and it's just leaving imprints on my thumb. I hope I'm getting this right. Hold on. Yes, that goes this way. Okay, let's try it again. I'm sure this is right. Ow! Oh, 
Oh, man. It's got a little bit of goo in there, but I don't think that's like, uh, maybe. I think it would just like mash it out. It wouldn't like prevent me from getting it in there. I might have to wear gloves to get this thing in here. Oh, okay, finally, satisfying snap. Okay, so cool. And it does look really cool. I like it. You can't really see a seam in there, can you? It's all connected. Okay, and then this is supposed to go up to his head. The big part right here, the big bone. Oh, it's got to turn it over this way. I think that's right. And then we got the tail end. And how's that work? Yeah, that would kind of make a little bit more sense. So yeah, thanks to camera mom. Oh, I didn't build dinosaurs like this when I was a kid. I just got a bunch of linking logs and, you know, built something, <laughs> okay? And it kind of resembled a dinosaur, at least in my imagination, I had a big imagination with those linking logs. Okay, and that goes on the side, right? Oh, it's not snapping into place. Come on, don't wiggle it too much. And it, do I have the spi spines down? Yeah, spines down, okay. This part is down for whatever reason, just shows that that's the way it is. And then we gotta build this. So it's gonna go on either side. So there's an L, does it say L? In the oh, does it, say it says L right there, see? It says L, L for like, you likey? Go ahead and likey, <laughs> hit the likey button. And you subscribe -y. Yeah, which way does it go? This way, and okay, so there's the extensions right there, and there's the holes right there, so we're just gonna put the holes, or the extensions into the holes. I'm not sure if it's supposed to make a satisfying snap. Oh, well, it better, because it ain't staying in. I think I got this. Oh yeah. Oh, okay. Now that that's firm. Yeah, I'll buy that. That's firm. And then this side, we'll put this in. Oh, just gotta make sure. All right. Oh, one side goes in. Okay, you really have to push to get that in there. But man, that's like a firm, a firm, uh, solid uh, dinosaur right there with the bones. So next, oh, we got the G and the H. I hope they really they got a G and an H. Okay. Oh, this one says G right there. G. We got it. And then the H and these. Oh, I'm so glad that you put the letters on these. And then there's the H right there. Okay. Uh, so we're gonna put that together. Gotta get extra gunk out of there. Okay. So the G faces that way, and the H goes like this. Okay. Got it. That's nice. Okay, so I can figure this out. I think that looks so weird. I know the color's like way off. Okay, I gotta get the gunk out in between his bones with the fork here. And this is gonna be I and J. Oh, I gotta make sure I do this right. It helps if you try to turn it the right way. There we go. Okay, yeah, the bones don't match, but that's okay. It's uh, maybe I just need to get some uh, modeling paint, you know, <laughs> work on it. And then we've got the E and the F. Oh. Okay, I didn't think it'd make a difference, but but we're missing another foot. Where did the feet come from? No, it's in, it's, it's in the. Feet. It's right here. Sorry, I didn't. Oh, see camera that. mom's playing off in her like sands of time and. It's fun. Make me look like I don't know how to unbox a toy. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know where the parts are. <laughs> so hold on, we got an E and the F. Oh, it's kind of tricksies. So the E's facing this way. And so the foot's gonna go, oh, okay. I think I got it. And we'll just do it with the other one with the D and the uh, C. This one's just gonna be, have to D and the C. So now I gotta go the other way. So the C's gotta be at the top and this has gotta come at the bottom. Wow, okay. Oh, jeez. All right, so I have to face them up like this and the C goes on this side, C. Oh yeah, I think that's like that. Oh, he looks kind of weird like that. And then the E and the F goes on this side. Okay, and then for the other side, the I and the J goes on this side. So is this the I and the J? No, this is the I and the J. Okay, and then by deductive reasoning, whatever we have left, we'll go there. Okay, let's see if this works, guys. Okay, he's supposed to have one paw kind of up like he's walking, you know? Kind of like this. That's cool, guys. And he, you know what's the funny thing is? Everything is gone. He has no flesh except for his eyeballs. <laughs> So you guys see where he's going and look at these back dark <laughs> legs there it just kind of looks a little bit off but that's okay guys put in the comments if you get anything like this has any part of the bones that's dark it just kind of looks a little bit off but i still like it, it looks really cool And then, okay, so the last thing we want to do is we want to do the smasher eggs. We have a total of six of them, right? And guys, we got to take a look at that so we know what we're getting ourselves into. I mean, how many are there? Does it say over there's 50 to collect or something? No. But you can see up at the top, you got the skull smashers and the bones that are like kind of gold. They're ultra rare. There's a total of six. You can get carcass brown, which is, you know, the serial number 3-001 or carcass two, which is orange 3-002. Well, you guys get the idea. Numb skull. <laughs> 
<laughs> I didn't call you that. That's what it says right here. Dumb school. No, I didn't call you that. <laughs> bonehead. No, it's right here. <laughs> bonehead. So you get two different colors of carcasses, numb skulls, and boneheads. You either get the brown or the orange, and they're all super ultra rares. Then you have the dino fossil categories, which you have them red bones, and they are all rares. And you got crustosaur, fossil fish, stone shells, gravel raptor, and rock wings. And then you got the exclusives, which are in green, so it's a, it comes from another play set. And then you got the blues, which everything else is just common. You got a lot of commons. So you got these zombie dinos, which sounds pretty cool. Then the glowing evil dinos. Now you think those would be ultra rares, with glowing because that sounds cool and then you got the cave zombie triceratops, zombie rex zamoth and zomodactyl <laughs> then you have the toothy dino and then you got the next one robot dinos dino droid mechanosaur and robo rex and dinosaur and then wretch tech Dino eggs. Then you got the cool little ones, the crackers, the ahegs, the fatosaurs. <laughs> Man, they come up with a lot of pejoratives here. Name calling? Jeez. And then you got the mutant dinos down below, the snail age, a crabosaur, you know, like Krusty the Crab, you know, SpongeBob, Octodino. These are cool, man. These, even though these have been out for a little while, this is the one I think to get. They really did good. I love it when they keep them like where you can get ultra rares and stuff because that makes it more exciting. You guys think we'll actually find any in here? That's what we're going to find out. So let me go ahead and you got the uh, eggs here. Here. Okay, butamus. And then you have the perforations here, which, you know, you can dig your fingernail if you got one, but you gotta be careful not to get that plastic in between the nail and your skin, because, ow, what a slice. And what we'll do is let's just go ahead and get all these unwrapped. Okay, guys, here we go. Accidentally, we were, I was tearing one of these open and it smashed, so I put it back together. We'll have a timing, you know, like the Rubik's Cube Championship, dude. We'll see how fast I can put this together. And if I do, I win a million bucks. You know, somebody has, you know, a million change to give to me. So let's go ahead and smash these open. One. Oh, what's this dude? <laughs> He's a little chagrin dino, dude. What do we get? He's green. He's mean. Uh, I gotta identify him. He's got wings. Look at his eye, and he's got punched in the eye. I threw that smasher too hard. Oh, it's a bat raptor. He's a mutant dino. Oh, man, he's at the bottom. <laughs> Jeez, at the bottom of the, the whole collector's guide. He's at the very bottom. Oh, I guess we can only go uphill from here. <laughs> here we go. Ooh, Ooga, Toga, Toga. He looks good. He's a glowing evil dinos. He's the cave zombie. He glows. Right. Yes! Okay, we're up there. We're going to the top now. All right, here we go. Oh, and look at the bottom of this dude. A pencil top here for the eraser. There you go. Go on a scale, and you got your vomiting triceratops. See the green coming out of it? So it's a Robo Dinos in that collection there, and it looks like it's a Robo Rex 3-063. I mean, they put numbers, serial numbers, you know, so you just can't, you know, when you're trading and stuff, you can say, Hey, can you give me that vomiting uh, triceratops? No. When you text your friends, you say, can you give me 3-063? They know what you're talking about. <laughs> so there you go. That's cool. Love it. Okay, we got three left, guys. Come on, we got to get one of these gold skull smashers. No, but we got something that looks cool. Very colorful, I will say. So this one, whew, Dino Egg. This is a Fatosaur. So he's fat. I would guess he's uh, 3-080. And he's a pencil topper dude too. So you see he just fits right there, guys. That's cool. Does it erase? I doubt it. It kind of does, but uh, just kind of. Well, see if we do this. See that? I scribbled on the table. Get the nose into it. Does it erase? It'd probably shred your paper before you got it <laughs> It seems like it's okay. All right, here we go. Okay, we got a fossil. And anything that's got a lot of color to it, actually, it's a dino fossil. We actually have a rare. Wow, didn't look like a rare, but it is a rare. <laughs> that's cool. It's a gravel raptor, 3-018. And then, of course, this one's got, like, this way, okay? There you go. Gravel Raptor. We are rare. Like and subscribe. <laughs> okay. This will be the Gravel Raptor. Raptor. Okay, nice. We got one left here in this batch. Okay. 
the blue hunchback zombie freaky looking dude. Yeah, he's gotta be a mutant dino. That's what I'm looking right now for. Is it a shell smasher? It kinda looks like a shell smasher. I think it's a shell smasher, yeah. So that's a dino eggs. That's all it is. He's coming out of an egg. Okay, and he's got, you know, a hole there for the pencil top. All right, guys, so this is how you put it back together. You need, uh, well, you gotta have a bottom. So let me go ahead and show you that the curviest one between these two, that one's gonna be the top and the less curvy is gonna be at the bottom. And then you gotta have two sides you know, to your buffet, your dish. And then you've got to have two, well, other sides. Okay, so that's all you need right there to go ahead and build your smasher. Okay guys, for our treat that we're gonna put inside of here is to have a whopper of a good time. You know, I wanna have a little something. I'm gonna get hungry here, and so who doesn't like whoppers? So there you go. Actually, before you put the candy in there, it's probably good, better to put the sides on. So you have the sides here. You have the longer end of the spoon here and the shorter end. The short end is gonna go down first, okay? Short ends down. Okay, after you get to this point, then you want to put your pencil top or your candy in here. Oh, perfect. And then you get your smashers, you know, the label side up and put it on this side and label side up and put it on the other side. You just slide it right in there. That's the easiest part. The hardest part is come after when you get the big arch right here and you want to push it through, lift it up, and then as you're lifting it, probably see if you can get your finger to lift it up to get it over the lip here. And then, you know, apply pressure on the backside too. So I'll get it through. The first part's easy. The next part is to push up with your thumb and lift up with your uh, index finger and just keep sliding and lifting and sliding. You gotta fuse your way, baby. Whew. Oh man, that's so cool. Get shake, get shake, get shake, get shake, get shake. I got treats, man. Oh, that was so disappointing. <laughs> Yum! All right. Multi deliciousness, goodness. Okay. The green bone. Okay. That's our crazed source here, Brachiosaurus. Next, um, we want either our twisted transverse rack or our fossil rock triceratops. So, who do you think is going to be the T Rex? The white bone or the more muted white? <laughs> So I think Triceratops is going to be this one. Should we do Triceratops? We'll say the T-Rex, the white bone. In fact, if anything, this darker bone ought to go with this dude. He's got the dark bones, but all right. So you go, guys. Same thing, but this one's just uh, off-white. It didn't know how to become white, so it says I'm just a little off. And then let's go ahead and start opening it up. Now, remember, they might have two layers of plastic here. Ugh. And they do. I got to do it again. It did such a clean uh, unwrapping that I have to... Oh, there you go. It's just not working for me, man. All right. Got it. This one, you see the perforations here? It's very lightly like um, cut or perforated or indented here. Compared to this side, the other side, you see it's more visible. So that one, we got to get more traction getting this plastic off. So we have to go from one side to the other and, oh, not even a sweat. Okay, how do we want to do it? Got to do it. Oh. There you go. All right. So we got our off-white. Let's go ahead and rebuild it real quick. Should have seen camera mom jump when I just... Ah! <laughs> You'll notice when the camera is shaking, although I think it has anti-shaking in there, so it wouldn't matter. Make her look like she's steadied hand throughout the whole thing. All right. So there's our off-white and, you know, thing, the collector side. Okay, great. Here we go. Okay, ready? <laughs> just... I want the air current going camera mom's way. <laughs> Okay, camera mom. All right, not a fizz. Oh yeah, that's bad. <laughs> Guys, make sure you do this in a well-ventilated area. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Who did I say would be in this uh, off-colored one? Not the T-Rex. Triceratops. Triceratops. Well, I got a skin in Fortnite, Triceratops. And guess who we got? You are good. Yeah, I knew it was an off-white thing for her, you know, so we're good. Now we're just ready to build. We just got to go ahead and get the map out. And it's going to be the same thing, right, guys? I mean, there's the front and there's the back. And I assume when you scratch in the back, it's going to be lead you through the same steps here. I mean, we'll try one, but I think it's all going to be the same. The only thing different is you're going to have different bones, you know? So the first one ought to be, yeah, right, don't keep your head in the sand. Well, we know what sand is. It's dino dirt. <laughs> Okay, let's just verify. Trust but verify. Yep. Okay, so we can just follow the same steps, I think, guys, and we're good. Well, here, let's get more dirt for this dude, right? Ah, this is really hard to... Uh, it, it really is. <laughs> okay. Hopefully I left. There's... I can't even get my finger in between that little plastic that's available. Okay, there we go. 
I love the Dino Dirt. It's super cool. And who do we get in the Dino... I mean, what body part do we get in the Dino Dirt? <clears throat> That's got to be the head. Wow. Whoa. Look at that. Whew. That's cool. Oh, look at the tongue. They painted that red. Look at that. Just, hey, I, I, you can't subscribe. Well, I can think I could put... I don't need any instructions just to give her lower jaw together, okay? Oh, and it's movable, too. That's cool. I love that. I love the horns. I always love Triceratops with the horns. You can just spear uh, the T-Rex, you know. I think that uh, they'd be pretty tough. So there we go. I think that's it. And then you got, we just got more sand. You know, you know the sand thing. Wow. It still kind of looks a little bit spider webby, doesn't it? It does. Oh, that's just cool sand. It's kinetic. <laughs> <laughs> Next, we want to go to the fizz. Oh, yes. <laughs> I want to do the fizz. It's so cool looking, but you know, it's just, uh, like I said, well ventilated area. Don't open your mouth. Okay, everybody close your yappers. Ready? You got to think of the viewers, too. Yeah. Safety for everybody. Look at you. Billy, stop gawking, man. Close that yapper. Okay, here we go. <sighs> Close, close. <laughs> Keep it away from me. <laughs> double, double, toil and trouble. Fires burn, corn syrup bubble. Fizzy, but yeah, that's still going. It's really cool. I mean, I've never seen this much fizz in any toy. Fizzy substance. Even in Treasure X, they gave you a little bit of a burp. You know, in the series one of Treasure X, it's really cool. And it was cool that when you're done fizzing, if you found gold, that's super cool. I think Zero ought to put gold <laughs> in their T-Rex. Or a diamond, you know, the pressure there. Get oil, just get diamonds. Either that or like, Look, Daddy got a can of oil, man, and my Zero Smasher. <laughs> Great, son, go change the oil. <laughs> Stirring doesn't help, guys. It doesn't go any faster, but it's really cool. Maybe if I actually break it up. Oh, then you get the feet, okay? So, Triceratops feet. There we go. Well, you got to get that off, though. Okay, we got, I think, one foot. Another foot. I'm glad they float. Really cool. So much easier. Well, that one's got a clump of a honk. Still fizzing. We're still working on that one. Okay, I think we got the last two fitzies here. There we go. Well, we're going to the next step, which is our... Oh, the <laughs> slime. Oh, I think there's structural issues with this thing. Whoever made it. Ugh. Oh, yeah, I threw the other slime away. It was just so nasty glowing in the dark slime. Okay, we got to make sure we keep this. Maybe I can th get it out of the garbage can. No. Okay. Uh, uh, I don't know if this is any better. Let's see. Well, this looks a little bit promising. It's really not funny when it comes to a fast and running diarrhea. <laughs> diarrhea. It's just a grade school thing we used to sing as kids. <laughs> So look, it's actually cohesive. That's real slime. I think that's real slime. I don't think that's real diarrhea slime. <laughs> and it should glow in the dark just fine. Okay, here we go. Remember Star Wars, the Tom Tom? We had to go in and with the lights here. Oh, this is where I'm going in. Oh, it's so slimy. Oh, it's just not right. I think my hand's now glowing in the dark. Okay, this is real slime. This one's actually not so bad. It's not so bad. So I have to hang on to this one. All right, so it's coming off pretty good. My mom always told me to eat, you know, certain foods because it stick to your ribs. <laughs> so you weren't as hungry as much. Oh, yeah. there you go, mom. <laughs> Yuck, that reminds me of the cafeteria food. Goulage. And who in the world would ever come up with a, like, a stew that's called goulage? I mean, just the name of it makes kids shudder and cringe. Hey, what's this? Ew. There's some white stuff. Is that for my hand or something? Oh. That just doesn't seem right. I just don't know with these dinos, man. They're so old. They stink. They're extra snotty. They're slimy. We've got like some white stuff in there. Is it bleaching off the bones? The whiteness? I don't know. Okay, let's just try and get this done. <laughs> <laughs> There's the tail. Ugh. Why are you taking so long? <laughs> uh, just because that's part of the fun. I know. Parents are giving, you know, Billy this. It's like, I'm going to buy us 10 hours. <laughs> <laughs> they come back, and to their dismay, the slime's all over the walls. What are you doing, Billy? I can't get off my fingers. <laughs> It wasn't me. Really, we had slime in here from Ghostbusters, just slime in the whole place. <laughs> okay, so you see that? There's like some white mixture in there. Yeah, and it's not mixing up, which is really gross. I just don't know what to like make of it, you know? We'll do the glow in the dark thing after, okay guys? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, oh. <laughs> 
there's actually bones in here. I think they're dried off now. Okay, I think it's uh, still orangey and stuff, but so far we're looking good. The bones for the most part look white. Alabaster. I like to use different words, you know, to make me sound totally intelligent. Okay, what's next? Yeah, okay, we gotta break our rock. Look at that, it just kind of flies. <sighs> the dust. Oh, he's very gritty. Mm. Gosh, there's get rid of your constipation. Metamucil, drink that, man. It's all gritty stuff. Woo! Okay, here we go. Uh, I know, we, the digging tool, but I, I can just break it, right? We're okay with breaking things, right? Oh. Same color. You know what? It's just the color of the rock that's like turning this dark. Bleaching them? Yeah, now it's just really so. I guess it gives it character, right, guys? We're good with that. All right, so next we want to open the last one is the Ice Age Putty. And this putty's really cool. I like it a lot. Okay, here we go. It's just so cool. You can see the snowflake right there. Isn't that just butamus? I love it. And this stuff, I think you can keep forever as long as you have it in a sealed bag, you know? And it's just oh, so cool. Of course, you have to wash your hands after, I assume, because of the glitter. I think, yeah, I got some glitter on my thumb there. All right, so what are we looking at? We got one bone. It looks like we got, oh, what is that? Oh, let's get the other bone out first. That one's easier. Okay, wow. It's a lot in between the holes right. here. It's really in the holes, you know. We gotta dig to get all this stuff out so everything will just settle in when we connect them all together. Oh, really? It's such a small hole. I don't know if the fork, oh, the fork did it. I think that's the pelvis for Elvis. Oh, thank you very, thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now we gotta build it together here. Oh, I just love this. In fact, if you kinda like, just, I think it'll actually settle. So if you just squish, squish it, squish it, squish it, squish it, squish it into a ball. I think it'll settle by the end of this video. It should just all settle down. Here we go. So first let's do the head thing. We got the jaw. We, we're good. Uh, step two, we got to get this going. Oh, it's got some of the glow in the dark snot. And then it says, put this together like this. Okay, it's snapping. There we go. You really got to snap it together. I mean, and it looks pretty cool. It looks a little bit, you know, got a little seam there, but it's, it's solid. Okay, and then after that, step three, I'm going to put it up in its head. There we go. It's looking cool. She's looking good. I just think it's a she because, you know, Sarah. Try Sarah. Four. Oh, and then we got the uh, hip joint thingy, which is supposed to go okay. It's supposed to go in a hole here. It's got to be a snap, right? Oh, yeah, I heard it. That's a good snap. See, it looks seamless. That was, that's super cool. And then next, it wants us to put the tail here. Okay, now we get to put the feetsies on. E and F. There's E. I'm so glad they labeled these. J and uh, okay, first time I ever wanted to get an F in my skill work. <laughs> okay, there. Okay, that works. And then the other one is going to be C or D. All right, G and J. Right. Nice. And then this one. Oh, okay, cool. Now for this side, I want to do it on my side here. E and F, and it's going to go to the front. Oh, that's a satisfying snap. And then so on this side it's going to be I J. Okay. Oh, that's just cool. It's coming together. It's so easy. Okay, let's flip it over. We don't need to look down because we know what we're doing now. Okay. That looks good, guys. She's a beaut, man. Oh, she's a real beaut. Oh, look at that. She's cool. Right, we can bend it and we can open your yapper. Yeah, 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 yeah. Num num. That's cool. They really did good on these guys. I really love them. They're super cool. And then, okay, we gotta do our smashers now. Okay, so right now, the top of all our smashers is this dude right here. The Dino Fossils is in the rare. We got to hit our ultra rares, okay guys? Okay guys, we got our six smasher eggs. Let's go. Ugh. What do we got? Oh, it's a snail. Uh, it looks cool. Uh, the colors are awesome. They did really cool on these smashers and it's a racer top there. Uh, if it does erase, I do not know. Oh, it, it's a mutant dino. It's at the very bottom. So it's a snail age 3-087 for you collectors out there. Okay, next one. Oh, no way. No, 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 no. This has got to be an ultra rare bonehead because it's supposed to be numbskull. Oh, we got an ultra rare numbskull. No, 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 I got to confirm this. I got to confirm because it doesn't have color on it, does it? And it's brown or it's red. Yeah. 
it's gonna be fun. It's just a delayed reaction, guys. We got an ultra rare. Woo! And if it isn't, don't tell me. <laughs> this is so cool. Look at this. Ultra rare, guys. In Num School. It is 3-003. And it's 9,650 SP. Is that for like the ultra rare? Oh my gosh. No, they do have them here. So 10,000 SP must be the, the best you can get, the most ultra of the ultra rares. Guys, this is like third place in the ultra rares. I don't know what SP stands for, but that's what I'm thinking. <sighs> don't breathe on it. We'll package it up. It goes to the highest bidder. The bidding starts at 99 cents. Hopefully we'll get it to a buck five by the end of the day. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so cool. It actually comes in. Oh, <laughs> it comes in these like big eggs. That is so cool, guys, an ultra rare. I'm hanging on to that one, guys. That's cool. Let me know if you guys got an ultra rare too. And don't tell me if you got better than a 9,650 <laughs> SP. I do not want to know. Because <laughs> the next one up is 9,800 and then 10, oh my gosh. Uh, you know what? I really want to get the boneheads. The boneheads looks cool. Of course, I'd love to get the carcass, the ultra ultra of the ultra rares, but a bonehead just seems like it's a more, you know, piratey stuff. What are the odds if we got another ultra rare here, guys? Oh, look. It's Sebastian gone mutant on us. Haha, <laughs> under the sea. That's where you put your toxins. That's where I get all loxins under the sea. <laughs> now this is a Krabosaur and it's a mutant dino. It's 3-091. Actually, you know what? I'm looking at all these SPs. I do not know what these SPs mean. Can somebody tell me what an SP is? Because it gets up into the 10,000s and you got 8,000. So this one SP, I keep thinking why SP for experience? I do not know. <laughs> so he's got uh, an SP value of 2896. Uh, the worst SP in all these, it looks like it's a Fatosaur. He's got 57 SP. That's really hitting the bottom. No, 37 was the Wretch Tech. Oh, does it go less than 37 SPs? 25, which is the Gummosaur. Oh man, does it go any lower than that? Are they Smasher Points? Oh, SP stands for Smasher Points. I like what Camera Mom says. Well, that's what we're going for, Smasher Points. Wow. So you may not get an ultra rare that has a ton of smasher points, but if you get enough collectively, you could override him and then take their smasher. I don't like that game. <laughs> oh my god. Octonaut. Oh, who is him? He's orange. It's the Octodino. He's got uh, smasher points of 2,370 and it's 3-095. Whoa. Man, the ultra rare is my baby. You are my baby. Okay, we got the Woody Mammoth. Okay, so he's a zombie dino? Yeah, he is. He's Zammoth. It's, uh, well, 387 smasher points. Well, he's a zombie. Zombies don't think. They don't have much brains. <laughs> so you can't give him any smasher points, right? Okay, last one. Oh, he's cool. He's gold. Man, he goldy docks. It looks like a robot, right? Yeah, he's a robot dino and his dinosaur. Smasher point 627 and the dinosaur is 3-067. I bet these are still popular, these ones, even though they've been around for a while because it's just cool how they assign numbers to them. And it's just, you know, kind of reminds me of Pokemons and they have the game cards you can play and stuff. And then you got your games you can do with your Smasher points. Okay, last one, guys. And this one is... Eggshell white bone. Okay, this is our T Rex. Uh, to be more specific, um, precisely, it's twisted Tyrannosaurus Rex. He's so twisted. Oh, oh. you didn't see that. <laughs> yeah, this one they chilled to this, and all it is, it just kind of, ew, feel a bit naked. There's only one layer of plastic, unless there's undergarments. I don't know. Okay. Oh, yes. Okay, let's hurry. Let's go. Oh, look, I didn't have to put that one back on. That's nice. Didn't have to crack it all the way open. And let's do this. Very nice. And then, of course, you know, we're building the, t uh, the twisted T-Rex, you know. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, man, we ought to do the pop. Did you hear that? Psst. That was a nice pop. Doesn't smell so bad. <laughs> It just doesn't. It, I think this one actually... Mm, minty fresh. No, okay, now it's coming out now. Whew. Oh, it's just so cool. You got so many fun things to do. It just keeps you going. It's awesome. Christmas morning, this would be a fun thing to get. Okay, we already got our hammer. You know, and then, you know, confirmation here. Our twisted, twisted T-Rex. Almost sounds like a rock group. My twisted sister. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the twisted T-Rex. Roar! Oh, roar! So here we go through the dino dirt again. Oh. 
Well, these last ones, a little bit hard to tear open, but hey, as long as I get an ultra rare, I guess it's worth the pain. And then it's so small. Okay, I bet his head's in here. He's got a big nougat. Oh, you old, oh yeah. He's got his hatchet in his head. <laughs> in the later Smash Dressors, when you have the hatchet in his head, he's got a googly eye, just like he's dazed. <laughs> you know, that gave him some character. Oh, look at his tongue. Oh, that's a worm, man. <laughs> Trying to get around his mouth. Oh, that nasty. All right, let's put this together. Uh, I just love the hatchet in the head, you know. I guess the K-Man uh, didn't get away after he got him there. Just ate him up. Uh, the worm. Okay. That is just so cool, that yellow sand. Oh, there we go, guys, in between. It is settling. That's awesome, guys. I love the stars. That's nice. Okay, what's next? Oh, we gotta do the fizz thing now? Oh, yeah, it's a fizzy thing. This just takes forever, you know. Fizz it. How else are we gonna get things out? Just have to soak it in water. I mean, you can try to break it, but that dust flying everywhere, I don't recommend it. Oh, see, it's already flying. Oh, but that first part is just so satisfying. Oh, it's just... And the bubbles, the popping. Oh, you can't get enough of that. I just can't get enough without you. Just can't get enough. I don't know. Look at that. All these yeah, bubbles. Bubble. This one's really frothy. Some orange tang. Oh, yeah. This is really weird, man. And maybe it's because we keep putting orange tang tablet after orange tang tablet in here. <laughs> just had enough. Yeah, look at this. And we're getting some snot bubbles in here, guys. So I don't know if we just got a mutant uh, orange fizzy here. Or it's because of the combination of all the orange fizzies. That's making these snot bubbles there. Look at this. It's so fun. <laughs> boink, 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 boink. That's just so foamy. I can't even show you it. All right. We'll be right back. So guys, really frothy. And out of all this stew, we got one giant foot. And I don't see anything else except a little bit of fizzy. I wonder, just because he's so big, I'm just thinking that they probably had the foot in one of these other bags here. And it kind of makes sense, but let me dry it off here so you can see the foot. Oh, that is huge. Oh, look at that. We still have more to like get out. Okay, back to the cesspool, no, you go. Just cut it out. <laughs> I'm not, oh, this is nasty. He's got to be cleansed and cleaned. While we work on this, let's go ahead and go to the next step. We got the glow in the dark slime, okay? Actually, at this point, it doesn't matter which order we go, we just got to go. Oh. Glowing in the dark. Oh, now, I'm going to do a test look in here. <laughs> Just so it's not mutant stuff. Here, let me put this off to the side. Because that last one, man, they got their slime. Just so awful. Okay, let's see if it runs out really fast. Okay, it's holding. It's got some good geel. Congeal. Oh, look. What is this white stuff? Is that, like, not right? Do I dare touch it? <laughs> You know what it kind of reminds you of? It, look, it's like it's coming. It might be dried out. Yeah, it, it may be just be drying. Uh, well, drying out shouldn't turn it white. And I thought part of the white from the lettering. Mm. But then, okay, it's a mystery, guys. Let's go ahead and, like, pull whatever we can out of here. Ah, oh, that's quite a bit, though. All righty. Okay, his uh, rib cage, somewhat. It's going in the dark slime. Actually, it might be good just to leave the slime on. Just watch him go in the dark so you can see him coming after you at night. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Okay, and then we got the tail. It's coming off pretty nicely for the most part. Okay, and then this white stuff. Can I even mix it? Ah, look at that. Oh, yeah. Well, it's going to be kind of fun to watch that glow in the dark there. Of course, the other one I couldn't pick up and show you, like, it lagging here. Just go... <laughs> you couldn't see it. Oh, yeah. It's just that white part. I don't know. Is that white part actually going to glow? We'll find out. Okay, who's ready for um, T-Rex foot stew? There, you get the broth there. All right, that looks good. On to the next phase. Oh, the dusty, dusty trails of a rock. I think the foot is in here. I mean, it's big enough. You think it's big enough to have that in there? It? Huh. It's more gray bones. <laughs> oh, yeah. Are these? Okay, yeah. It's, it really colored these bones. Okay, then the foot's got to be in here. Oh, well. You heard of the one-eyed purple people eater. Well, here's the one-legged T-Rex. People eater. Oh, we got a foot. Okay, we got a foot. Oh. <gasps> I don't want to have to put the bill and get another one of these here to make sure we got a foot. And we're going to pull them out and we got our frozen Olaf and Elsa. It's just so beautiful. We finally got the other foot. Okay, cool. There's the other footsies. And then here's little tiny arms. 
Oh, boy. I always felt bad for T-Rex and his little tiny arms, but his big yapper freaking me out coming after me made up for it, you know? So there we go. It's settling, isn't it, guys? In fact, if we put that right there, what do you think is going to happen? By the end of this video, we'll find out. Stay tuned! Okay, so we got to build him. Okay, so first things first here. You already got the hammer in the head. <laughs> so that's it. Okay, so this, and then he's got the other part. Oh, this should be an easy build. If I can just line the holes up just right. Yes. Yes, my precious. Yes. Oh, really? He's got holes there too. That's pretty cool. Zero did a really good job on uh, on these, and so it's not one of those flimsy things. He was barely put together, and then that goes up into the head. Oh, with that satisfying cut into my hands. Oh, come on. Ugh, I thought that was blood for a moment, but no, just snotty. The pressure's on. It will it come out, or is that just okay? I think we're good. <laughs> I'm not gonna push it anymore. It'll go right through my hand. Oh, we got D and C for the arms. A C D C. Okay, look at that. <laughs> it looks like you know Dr. Frankenstein went to the lab and just created this horrific monster, and then he forgot. Oh yeah, I guess we should have done something for the arms. <laughs> okay, yeah, he's got chicken arms. <gasps> okay, then we got G and H. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, so there's the hiney leggies, and I'm just gonna go for this side. There, okay, went in all the way. Nice. And this side, okay, it snapped in. Oh, and then tail for balance, right? Oh, come on, you gotta bend. Come on, El Boyo. Uh, you gotta be able to bend without breaking him. Okay, nice. Okay, he looks a little bit lot. You got a huge <laughs> noggin, these tiny arms, this little teeny tiny body and big feet. <laughs> Okay. He's got to go in a girl spurt in all the wrong places. He needs to level it out and stuff. Maybe a bigger bodice. Well, you wouldn't want a tiny head, though. A shrunken head. But he looks cool. I like him. And don't forget our Sarah coming after him. Blah, blah, blah. And he's going, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool, guys. His bones don't look off. Dark brown. They didn't have time to like stain. That's cool. Okay, so let's go ahead and do our smashers now, guys. Okay, stay tuned for our glow in the dark. So here's the first smasher. That's <laughs> another toga, toga, bone, bone. It's a. It's not a glowing evil dino, so it wouldn't be cave zombie. So this one doesn't glow in the dark. This one actually is a zombie dino, and his smasher point is uh, 1,000. But for the glow in the dark here, this guy is uh, 4,598. So that's cool. So this one is the serial number 3-027. Cool. All right, next. Oh, kind of cute lower jaw up there look like a bulldog a little bit he's got his like turkey leg or something <laughs> he just looks cute he's adorbs oh okay so he's a toothy dinos hey cool we got one from a different category i think this is our first one from the toothy dinos and he's a munchosaur and it's 3-055 he's got 836 uh, smasher points all right I was getting excited here because I thought that because it was brown, but this one's gold here. So we got look at another robot. And so this one's a robot dino and it's the robot Rex. He's got, you know, 87 smasher points. That's all. <laughs> 87 smasher poopsies, man. He, no, anyways, he's serial 3-064. Oh man, you're way at the other end of the spectrum, man. Okay, here we go. Oh, she's cute. A little triceratop for your pencil top. And it's a dino eggs. You know, 57 smasher points. Oh, jeez. Wow. Not much better. And it's 3-079. Oh, come on. We really hit the rock bottom. We got to get some higher end here. Okay. Eggy. So this one is dino eggs. And it's our shell smasher 3-081. 1,092 smasher points. Okay. All right. All right. Last one, guys. We got a hit, at least in the uh, rares here, because we kind of got the lower end. Okay, well, that one's not going to make it, because <laughs> it's got a little color to it. And so this is our Terra, da Terra, did I, Terra, didn't I? It's Batty. Batty Coda. My name is Batty. My launcher is a Batty. Potato in a Jackie. It's Batty Coda from Fern Gully. That's a good show to watch. You guys ought to watch that. Where is we at with the Batty here? Okay, so it's a zombie dino, and it's Zoomadactyl, 3-033, and it's got 590 smasher points. So, all right. But you know what? We got the ultra rare, and that was in Tricera Ops. So that's super cool, guys. And let's go ahead, and we got to do our glow-in-the-dark uh, little caveman, dude. And also our glow-in-the-dark slime. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, guys, we got our black lights, which will charge up these particles a lot faster and, you know, a lot brighter and last a lot longer. So it's our glow-in-the-dark cave, man. In fact, if you look around you on the table, it looks like a battlefield. Look at the dinos, man. 
Oh, okay. Well, let's just charge him up in three, two, one. He glows. Not really strong, but still, it looks cool. Okay. Then you can see, oh, look at the other characters here. I mean, they just pop in the black lights, you know. That's cool. So, guys, look at the Brachiosaurus. We got some slime still on him, and I think it's cool that you leave some slime on him. Three, two, one. That just looks cool. I mean, it, it fades, but you can kind of see it. So let's go ahead and charge up our slime here and see how much we can really get out of the goo. See if in even the white there. Okay, guys, in three, two, one. Not too bad. That white is really giving it some like weirdness to it. <laughs> kind of creepy, witchy. It doesn't retain the glow that well. So it is something, it does look kind of cool. Okay guys, which one's your favorite? Is the Brachiosaurus, the T-Rex, or the Triceratops? They all look really cool. I like the uh, teeth and the horns on the T-Rex and the Triceratops, but this one's kind of different, the Brachiosaurus, so it's still fun to build. But out of all of them, I think the T-Rex is my favorite, guys, so. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. We got more dinos coming for you guys as soon as we get them. As soon as something comes out, maybe from Zuru Smashers or also Treasure X. They also go from dinos and things like that. And so we're here and we hope that you'll be with us too. Thanks for watching, guys. Woo! And now on to the Fortnite challenge. Why well, I got to win in T-Rex's skin. I know it's not bones. I couldn't really find a bone outfit that was dinosaur and had bones. It was either the dinosaur or the other. And so is this okay, guys? Oh. Thank you, thank you. I know I can get on you. I love you guys. Hey, if you guys like the video here, the Fortnite, go ahead and put it down below. Rose, because that's what you're throwing at me, Rose. Not the thorny ones. Dethorn them. All right, guys, ready for another challenge where the uh, dinosaurs rule the Fortnite Earth world. Help. <laughs> if I can land my jump on the jump pad. Oh, man, this game isn't going to be going well for me. Oh, I hope I can land my shots better than I can the jump pad. Okay, going to my favorite landing spot. Jump. Man, I really like the skin. I'm glad they actually had the T-Rex skin. It wasn't just a battle pass skin. I mean, they offer it in the shop from time to time. You say it's legendary, but really the rarity. Guess they may offer it once or twice a year. I haven't seen it out that much, but God, I'm glad I got it. Okay, I'm not gonna quite stick my landing here up at the utility closet, but we can always slide. Root and scoot and buggy. Okay, scale the fence. Okay, from a bob wire. A bob with wires. Okay, that's cool. Got a prime. Let's go ahead and see if we can get any uh, shield. Nope, just Elmo. Ah, light slabbers. Slavers. Cool. Let's go ahead and slurp and burp. I think I hear somebody coming down, but I'm just going to continue to loot up. Oh, these light savers are so cool. Oh yeah, that's how you get your ammo. That's about all I use it for. <laughs> I haven't perfected it quite yet. Let's go ahead and get this big pot. Nice, a goo gun, yay. Uh, they've been hard to find in the past couple of games, but this one, I'm glad I found it here. Okay, let's take a potty break. Mm-hmm, another prime shotgun. I don't double up on my primes. I don't do prime time twice. Splash it out. Yeah, there's nobody here. It's like, I know it's in sweatier lobbies, nobody lands here. And in less sweaty lobbies, there's some people write me, it's like, man, I just need time to loot up. Okay, we'll take the E11 blaster, or for spamming purposes. Ah, oh, shockwaves, cool. Bye-bye, lightsaber. You know, a lightsaber swinging all around. I could do myself and others a mischief. Well, hopefully you others, but I've yet to really perfect that. I'm really not a Jedi at this point. Not even a Patty Wan. Okay, what's behind the wall? Oh, sweet. An ultra rare epic legend chest. Okay, I will take the Hunter Bolt action sniper rifle. Uh, pulse rifle, yes, a rifle there. And then, okay, what's in here? All right. Oh, Ark, I have, guess, a company's coming over for Din Din tonight. Oh, jeez. Uh, I haven't set the table yet. You'll have to wait. Dear, did you get the table set? Oh, no. I'm all alone. Oh, oh two. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Trash my house. Okay. Apparently, they're not getting along. I'll just hit the bush. So I can... Uh... Okay. I see them both now. Let's go ahead and see if we can snipe the one. Oh! <laughs> cool. Awesome. When you hit it, you hit it. It's better when they hold still. To go or not to go? That is the question. Nah, he's still busy trashing my house. Oh, there he is. 
Oh, totally missed my goo shot. I told you that jump pad was the jump pad was like oh, I missed that one too. Precursor, pulse rifle. Okay. I really gotta try my goo. I gotta practice. Now, that's what you do. You just gotta practice. Okay. You can't use the circle above. It's the lines below. I think. I think I. Hmm. Shotgun is doing no good. This far away. Holds it. Cool. Okay, good. Whew. <laughs> that was Rose Raggy. Did you say go scoop or close? I don't know. Okay, what we got here? Oh, another key. Cool. Oh, there's Mr. Wurtz. You know, Mr. Wurtz. Don't need you this game. Okay, we got a Lamborghini and somebody who left just chest open on the bed. <laughs> okay. Okay, I gotta go find this a vault. I got keys to burn and a Lamborghini to boot. Oh, come on, boost it. Need enough oomph to get over this hump here. That was a woofy. This is so cool to get the vaults and hardly everybody comes over here. Now they say it, if anybody's watching like, great, that's the spot I'm gonna hit. And then we, you know, we get into Fracker when I'm playing. I'm like, no, man, this is my vault, my baby. Look, I put my name on it. There you go, Adventure Van Dan. You can't take it, can't touch it. Oh, cool, okay. Goo gun, key, pot, lightsaber. Um, mm-hmm. Refresh, oh, gold hammer, totally. Sweet, that's looking on the up and up. See, Fortnite knows that I need help because I just couldn't land the jump pad at the beginning. <laughs> so it says, fine, we'll give you a legendary, we'll help you out. Yeah, people just leaving their Lamborghinis out all over the place. <laughs> Mr. Wartz, you're creeping me out, man, the way you just stared me down. No, I don't need you, Mr. Wartz, not in this game. I'll stare you down. Go away, Mr. Wartz. I hate it when they come over and they eat your bush and expose you. <laughs> you know, they roll, yeah, they roll on the bush, they roll over the bush, and you're just like, the bush disappears. You're like, ah! You feel like you got no clothes, you know, like one of those bad dreams where you go to school. It's like, man, I'm not wearing anything! Are you wearing underoos or something? Underoos. <laughs> Captain Underpants. Oh, there's somebody. I thought I heard somebody behind me. Um, Firebird, dude. Um, Shogun. Uh, scope isn't. Oh, is he's shooting up above. No, I... oh, he is. Somebody else is shooting him. Oh man, third partying. That's coincidentally right at the same time. Oh, there we go. Okay, I got the limb on that one. Okay, totally cool. I'll take it, man. Righteous. Oh. oh okay, he's looting. Can I get to him? Uh, oh, 110, man. I'm just. Oh, yes. I'm just in fuego. Okay, I lost her. Oh, hey, whoa, hey, easy. Ah. Wow, give a guy like a little bit of warning here. Oh, la 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 ding 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 dong. I love that, home alone. Staying at the ding 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 dong dong inn. Man, lightsabers are everywhere. They don't really save me. So how can the world can be lightsabers? Okay. Oh yeah, we're starting to recoup. Need some carn. Mm, delicious, better pop and splash the rest. Cool, we're at full uh, capacity here. Okay, 12 players left. Let's go ahead and zip line. You don't see sunset storms like this in Fortnite. Nope, this is kind of once in a rare one here. Oh, cool, goo gun. Refresh it, <laughs> extra five hits here, points. Mm, six players left. What a weird ghost town. There's no ghosts. Some sort of chrome flower child world. I'm not sure who's taking over the plants or the chrome. There's a battle that's being fought. We're gonna flip the map, then we'll get back to our old map. Corny crops, weeping woods, if I remember their names right. Bony burbs, they were all beautiful places. It'd be cool if we brought them back. Oh, cool. He knows I'm here. Or he doesn't, and he doesn't care. <laughs> Fine. Oh, 
Oh, landing in water. That's like a no-no, man. Because then it sends out the visual audio to everybody that are close by going, ah, somebody's swimming. It's okay. Go. Cool. Looks like there was a battle fought over here. Platform. Just gotta make sure you don't come around and down and surprise me. There we go. Oh, zip lining it. I think it's Ariana Grande. Huh. She made it. Oh, two players left. Yeah. Let me... Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, that darn edge of the corner. Oh, I could have taken her out probably. Oh, man. Okay. Oh. Okay. Well, this is how it ends in the uh, men's bathroom. <laughs> All right, I'll wait him out, man. I have no shame. Please wash your hands before returning to work. I'm gonna wait and just hold on to the very, very edge of the storm. I just not search the one place they least expect me. <laughs> In the El Baño. I gotta put a sign outside El Ocupado. Oh man, that storm is getting a little bit tight. Okay, oh yeah. I'm gonna just wait and hold out, hold out. Okay, they're getting anxious. Okay, I forgot to wash my hands. Um, oh, there they go. Let me go. Okay. Oh, it's the Scarlet Witch. And... Yes! <laughs> and I won with the crown, too. That was awesome. Yes! Thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to like and subscribe. We got more fun to come. Please click on one of these videos for more events of fun.